Resident Evil 4. It's so struggling watch and stuff. For watch out for me! I'll watch out for you! I think we're okay. I think we've done it. Yeah, we've done it. Well done, boys and girls. Teamwork effort there. Now we need to go and get her. That's pathetic. Right. Let's go. We're through. Now in here. Whew, a breather. I think there's a save in here. And there's also some sneaky treasures, so we can pick up that... Uh, that treasure. So we're just clear the area, look around the corners. Now I believe there's a um, in this chest thing. I think it's a grenade. So we're um, we find out. It looks like a grenade. It is a hand grenade for emergencies. Now here is the treasure actually, and oh, it's in that one. Okay, we will use a TMP. Oh, pardon me. We we will use the TMP shot for this because they're the cheapest ammo. Boom. I think this is a velvet blue. No, it's a spill. Okay. Right then, and we've got to the first um, merchant shooting mini game thing. So we should have some fun there. Right then, pick up this ammo. I'm just going to clear this before we talk to the um, to the merchant and see what we've got, just in case there's any more stuff. Uh, I think we're okay. No more things. We'll um, reload. Now we talk to Chumley. What you got for us? Welcome. Right, let's go do some shooting. Because, you know, when you're rescuing the president's daughter, like, look at all the guns here. You're telling me that us three couldn't, like, hold out. I bet you got some grenades and stuff as well. Look at the resolution of those guns. Right. Welcome. For this game, you need to use your weapons that I've selected, stranger. Choose your weapon type, stranger. Let's do rapid fire first. Okay. Not a problem. We'll do it. Look at that. You don't even have the stock. It makes me sick. So, this is going to be a little bit maybe challenging with you. So basically what you do is you just shoot these bitches. And you get actually more points for a headshot, but look how fucking like... Um... Oh, I can't even think of the word. Shaky, that's the one. Reload time. But try and move back a little bit. This is obviously way easier on the, um, the Nintendo Wii that I used to play, because then you don't aim like a jump. Come on, come on, headshots, headshots, oh now they're moving, I've got to scratch my nose, come on, they will go down if you're not quick enough on them, that's one, that one, there we go, is that all of them, I think we've done it, result, prize, 25 out of 25, score, number of prizes, 3, hell yeah, nice, easy, give me some money, what do you need, stranger, in game, you've been awarded 3 ball caps, nice, Okay, let's... Oh, no, I don't want to do this one again. Well, let's do it again, and then I'll just quickly see do we um, get any additional bottle caps. I don't think you do, so... Um, but I'll just quickly see. Oh, shit, there's a thing here. Got it easy. Plus 500 points. Number of prizes, three. So is that the same? That might be the same three, but we'll see. What do you need? Uh, end game. Been a three bot cap stranger. First row collection is complete, and I got 15k. So what that means now is we go to key treasures. We look at our little bot caps, examine. So we've just got three and threes. Yeah, okay. So we do it twice, and we got um, three each time. So we can view details. And it's really on with rocket launcher, and you can do sound. Stand back. Stand back. Stand back. Don't worry, Ashley. I'm coming for you. You can zoom. Yeah. Can he pan? No. And you got just generically on here. Ada! Ada! Leon, Leon, Leon help! I bet she says that. Leon, help! Yeah. <laughs> this one, um, what did he say? He said, like, oh, it's some Spanish song about a wedding, wasn't it? Did you send out those invitations? I told you no more than 50 people! Yeah. <laughs> and then Ada. We haven't seen her yet. Well, we have, but we've seen her legs, basically. Not really the worst part to see, to be honest. Leon, now! Now what? Right, so we do the, um, the ranged one as well. So sniping, this is going to be a little bit difficult. Well, not really difficult, but we'll do it with the pistol probably. Um, although it does go further back, so um, we'll see. One, two. Okay, now we've got Ashley to not shoot. You lose a lot of points if you shoot Ashley. And sometimes her little thing gets in the way. Ah, 
come on. Look at the fucking recoil. Oh my... This game. You, 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 you. Reload time. I will try and stand off centre because that's why. <sighs> Good. You. Jeez, what am I shooting? Like, like the, the thing that I'm shooting. Exactly. As in, like, the, the thing in my hands. Oh shit, dynamite guy. Kill the dynamite guy. Oh no, we missed him. That makes me sad. Number of prizes zero? Hits 21. I wonder is that because we've already got all the prizes from this round it doesn't matter which one we do it in. Let's see. Let's try one more time. Uh, end game. Uh, sniping. Let's try again. There we go. So we got a whole bunch of points today. If we don't get any trophies, that means that... Um, yeah, so we, we've got all the things for this for this one. Right, so we're done here. End game. Give me my shit back. Who has time for this? Right, let's take the... Uh, Sort this out quickly. Oh god, it's a mess. Nice. Let's go. Now we can save it. We get, got some more money, but we don't need to spend it here, so we're alright. Now then. Let's roll. You alright? I'm fine! Leave me alone! Ashley, wait! <gasps> what a fucking surprise. One oddly specific trap. Don't worry, Ashley. I'm coming for you. And a chapter. Hit ratio. Enemies killed. Number of times died. Oof. Total six times. Not the greatest. But um, I'll save again because fucking why not? Accuracies though, not too bad. It was around like 82% or something there. So um, you know, I'm pleased with that with the controller. Hunnigan, what happened? The transmission got cut off. <laughs> Salazar, how'd you... We've jacked the line. We didn't want you telling everyone any unnecessary information. Where's Ashley? Ah, oh, so she fell into one of our wonderful traps. We'll make sure we find her. Don't you worry about her. Oh, yes. I let our miserable insects out for some exercise down in the sewer. Thanks. That should keep me company, because boredom kills me. I look forward to our What's next What joke was that? In another life. Yeah, he really stuck it to him there. Thanks. Boredom kills me. Oh, shit. I watch out for you, Leon. Right. God, it looks a bit grainy here, actually. The video. I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely not me, because inventory, that's pretty clear. And there, yeah, that's pretty grainy. Maybe it's, I don't know, it's the, probably their lighting or something. So, um, I remember hearing from somewhere that the monsters down here, where, on my first playthrough, I heard, I can't remember where, maybe it says it in one of the little documents you come across, that the monsters here are invisible. So I was like, really, really scared. And I was walking quite slow, and I was looking all through here and thinking, okay, fuck, there's these invisible guys, like, how are you going to fight them? And I got... That noise there scared the shit out of me. Because I hear that they're invisible, and I'm walking down, and all of a sudden you hear this, like, great fall. And then, and then I just literally, when I heard that, I ran, and I was like, nope, I've got the fuck out of there. And obviously it's just an ambient sound that they do now that I understand now that I'm older and I play some more games a little bit more um, not so scared and stuff. But that one did whew, literally um, pants were replaced there. So we go down here, we get this um, this little crack. I can't remember what this is, probably a velvet blue. Oh, it's a flash grenade. Okay, that's nice. Now, if you had keen eyes there for a minute, you would have seen one of the, uh, the dudes. Now, I'll give you a second. Can you see anything around there? And obviously not where I'm pointing to be in the screen. Now I'll show you. There you go, there's a game for you. Now these little things here, this like they dribble and stuff like that. So that's how you can kind of spot them at a range. So you just line that motherfucker up and you go crack. And then he's down. Bitch. 
And I think he's just gone. So he's dead. So keep an eye out for those. And that's how you know where they kind of are. Now some of them do... Why have we got the music? Some do kind of like spawn in places that you kind of can't really see them beforehand. Um, but if you're slow, you go around careful. Like sometimes I think they can be on the ceiling as well. So um, we're just keeping a little eye out for them. Don't want to be caught unawares. There's definitely one down in that little pool. So I don't think we can get it from here. But we maybe go around. Possibly now we can get it without pissing them off. Yeah, so you can see there's two in there. So we're crack you. And we're crack you. you. Oh, shit, I missed. Luckily it didn't piss them off. It's tiny little head. And now they're gone. Now these guys actually... Um, do we have much ammo do we have? We have? Okay, we don't have enough to reload. That's fine. Um, the death animation that these guys can do is pretty... Um, hardcore because they spit acid on you and they do like a grapple attack and how it kind of works is that the the grapple attack continues until you spam enough buttons to break free but if your health gets low enough um the acid that they kind of just barf all over leon's face melts kind of his skin off of his head and then he's just left with a uh, a nice little skull so what we will do is we're going to use that green herb just to get our health up um, can we reload this now? We can. Look at that. That's so, like, 5 FPS when you reload there. So we've got another friend in now. So he's now visible, so that's fine. So we just... Oh, we can kick him. What was that? Did he hit me there? Yeah, he did, didn't he? Oh, shit. Now we need to... Um, uh, when, when they're coming at you and they're kind of invisible, it's probably best to just shotgun that motherfucker because it's got the widest spread. And now we... Oh, God. He's gone on the scene like a little bitch, hasn't he? You know what, mate? Out of it. Hey, you're not dead? Shit. Look at this. He's like Jackie Chan over here. So, as you can see, it's, um, oh, fucking hell. As you can see, it's definitely, um, fuck, I'm gonna get, like, killed by this bitch. Can you die? Yeah, now you're dead. Um, definitely worth killing them before they hit Yeah, Because, uh, he just fucking wrecked me there. Oh, shit, there's another one. Come on, um, can I get a real cheeky hit on him with this? This is probably enough damage to just one shot him, yeah, so, um, that's alright. Now we've still got the music, so we need to be a little bit careful here. And uh, it looks like we've got some drops, so we grab that. Don't want to miss out on those green eyes. Now the eyes and stuff that I'm picking up, they are, what's this? Doors too rusted and won't budge, okay, that's fine. One of these we can open though, and there's a... Yeah. It's a yellow herb, that's nice. It looks like he was alive until just recently. Judging by the wound, it was a quick death. Take that yellow herb. And I think it's a sack in the toilet, or can he just check the toilet? Maybe, no, maybe you can't. Maybe I was just checking the toilet, like, as a kid. Because, you know, that's what you do. So, let's think. Grenade, take. There's a dude, come in, you can hear him. And we're just going to fuck him in the ass as soon as he comes around. Please don't be like above me, because that would be like really shit. Obviously, I mean, I'm playing this the most brave way. That guy just got fucked. He's still alive. What a bitch? Now you're gone. Okay, music's gone. We're safe for a little bit of time, and we pick up what you got. Another green eye. Yeah. So the eyes—they uh, actually fit in stuff. If we check them out, key treasures. Uh, examine. The markings on the sides of the stone indicate that it was once set in something. So we'll um, keep hold of them. Because they might be useful down the line. So we grab this uh, shotgun. And there's another paper here. I think this is from Luis. Luis's memo. Ten pages. So I'll just click through this. You can pause the video to um, see each page. So basically what he was talking about there is uh, the different parasites. So you've got like the, the villager ones that had that kind of like slashing whippy type head. Then he mentions the um, the ones in the castle who have that kind of like big fat worm attachment. And um, then some of the others. Like I think, he, I think he does mention these guys here, the um, invisible fucks. So um, can we can't open that? No. Now there's still a few more of these dudes. We're not out of it yet. I believe there's like, you do a thing and then I think maybe like one spawns on the ceiling that you can get like a cheeky hit on. 
I think. So we go through here, and um, yeah, that door's closed. So we pick up some of this treasure. Well, we've got some more shotgun, that's nice. And in here we've got green herb. Okay, so we combine our green herb with the yellow herb. So we've not got Ashley anymore, which is good for a while, so we don't have to kind of look out for her. Uh, the butterfly lamp. So this is actually the thing. So we should go to key treasures. And if we inspect the butterfly lamp, examine the exquisite lamp designed with butterfly motifs. There are three indentations, like something might fit inside. So we should go combine with the red, combine with the uh, this one. And you can't actually combine it with more than one. So you, we need, I think it's blue is the last color. And then we can sell that for some more moolah. So let's, um, looks like it's a drainage valve. Yes, a valve. Drain the water. Yes, there we go. So... Got rid of the water. Progressing. Like, now I guess the plan is to get Ashley back. And then where, was HQ sending out another chopper? I can't remember. I think so. And then we had to run to uh, lay low in a castle. And Yeah, so there you can see this little dick bag. So I think you can just make out his head there. It flashes now and then. So I think a headshot is maybe just a... Is that just going to kill him? Yep, he's gone. And there's another one. Look at that. He's right back. Friend. Now there's the head, so we go bang. Any more? Or are you done? I think we're okay. You can hear the ambient sound is um, ramping up a little bit. Is that just dripping or is that coming from something? That I believe is just dripping, okay. So I probably shouldn't really run around straight with the uh, this rifle, because if I get like real close to something, then... It's going to be a bit hard, but... Is that definitely... Is that dripping, or is that... No, that is dripping, yeah. Keep an eye out. So, considering the amount of damage... I mean, usually I'd be a little bit more like, okay, let's just fucking do it, but... Considering the amount of fucking damage that little bitch just did to me... Um... I ain't dicking around with these guys, because... I've only got X amount of... Oh, fucking hell, I am dicking around with them now. Um... I've only got X amount of healing. Down, bitch. I have time for you. And again, while you're still on the floor. I ain't letting you go. Okay, I'll let, I'll let you go. out. It was only as a, as a, like a friendship thing, so... Don't kill me, I don't kill you. I lied, I'm gonna kill you. Right, let's do him, let's do him! Yes, he's gone, easy. Get some more, um... Green eyes. And is this gonna be red eye? No, it's green eye as well. Now, there should be um, one more jump down here. So if we very slowly walk to the edge, we might be able to catch him. Or am I wrong? I can't really remember. It's definitely one through this door. I think behind here, is there a thing? Nope. So, can we actually see him from here? Mm, no. So, and slowly open the door. Not what I had in mind, Leon, but... Oh, for God's sake. Oh, is that, that's definitely a behind. That's a behind job, that is. Look at that, they're trying to do you. The sneaky game. Sneaky game. Right, you. No, fuck you. But just gonna lay the paint on him because in case there's another dude um, coming from behind, which don't sound like there are. Now he can't get into us without coming down to our level because the uh, the gate is closed. So not the gate is closed, but you know what I mean. It's like he can't run on the ceiling; he has to got drop down to get through here. So we can kind of just wait. I hope. Yeah. Now he's gone. And we we'll grab wherever he drops. Green eye again. Now, you do obviously get way more of the eyes than the little butterfly lamps. I think you pick up maybe... You definitely pick up another one later on, but maybe two more, I can't remember. Um, but, so you, you can save onto the um, the eyes and stuff like that. But what you can do is if you play, end up doing through like a, a second playthrough, you can just save all of your eyes and then as soon as you get the lamps. Because I think you don't get the blue ones until much later. Um, but you can save all of your stuff and then sell that stuff straight away when you get the lamps. Um, right, so this, I think we just have to walk through it kind of like on our own. I don't think there's quick times for this. No. So there's obviously a treasure there we can see. Let's see if that's going right through the middle. So we should go ADO. And there's a double here, which ain't too bad, so we just run. Easy peasy. Pick up another velvet he blue. Let's see, there's no like disable mechanic here, I don't think. So we just run through. And we're done. We're done with the little bugs for now. So, um, if you were scared, you can look back, because now we've just got some, like, hideous monks and stuff to uh, fuel your nightmares. So, let's crack on through here. What a pleasant surprise. But 
I'm afraid it's Ashley we need. Not you, Mr. Kennedy. If you don't need me, then get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? It might come as a surprise, but I'm only 20 years old. 